this video is for iPhone users and of course also iPad and iPod users but more for iPhone users iPhone users that want to back up their contacts so if you have your contacts on a phone let's say you have it on some old iPhone and you want all these contacts you know um, combined or uh, with uh, your new phone then it can be a kind of headache but I'm gonna show you how to do it in this video first of all we're gonna turn off our internet here because we have some changes in iOS world and now we have some other cautions to take care of so we're gonna start up iTools after we turned off the internet uh, as you can see it's starting up two times because I have two iPhones connected the iPhone 4 and my iPhone 6 so let's get into the live desktop so I can show it a little bit better to you let's go full screen there we are logging in and here we are in the iPhone we will have to go to the App Store and look for this app it's called easy backup easy backup my contacts you see that if you installed it and you open it you will get into something like this it will look like this and then you can hit the backup button if you hit the backup it will backup all the contacts that you have you see I have like 784 uh, contacts but uh, before you can do this you must first create an account and remember the cloud is not uh, the iOS cloud it's not Apple cloud this is their own cloud and it's really cool because now what I did I can now you know um, go to my backups and get my cloud backup you see that I have a cloud backup here with 773 uh, contacts and this I can transfer to any iPhone I want to so meaning if I have another iPhone and I need the same contacts on that iPhone you know I will go for this this is the very best way also if you want to downgrade for instance uh, I installed 8.3 yesterday I was very disappointed about 8.3 because I couldn't do things like this what I'm doing now showing you an app you know uh, I could not mirror anymore I could not go in uh, here I could not go into the apps and you know um, go for go for the you know the temp folders this all is now gone in 8.3 you will only see some icon here and iTools will tell you yeah you must pay you know that's why I turned off uh, the connection because I don't like iTools is connecting to their server I don't know what these people are doing on my computer so whenever I use iTools now it's blocked on my computer and I'm using version um, let's see what version this is about iTools 2.4.3 and this you can still download at um, soft tonic so you know I would go download it and just block it from going to the internet you know I mean like I don't I have no need to be on the internet now I'm creating a video you know no need that people are listening to me while creating the video and maybe if they don't like what I'm saying they just you know uh, make my whole Mac stock up it happened before you know uh, I am very suspicious these days and uh, yeah I love uh, turning off the internet of my computer I just love it especially if I do private things you know no need for uh, no company to listen to what I'm saying you know everybody's already listening to to your microphone and watching your cams you know but um, I think when I create my stuff you know I want to do it in all my private in my private uh, yeah place and I don't need nobody to listen to me or to mess up my work so peeps uh, this is how to get your contacts thanks again for watching peeps this is how to get all your can contacts back and this is how to do all the things that I'm doing and showed you in this video on your iPhone uh, like subscribe and till my next video